Good morning guys, welcome back to another weekend of my life vlog. I am very excited for the weekend. I woke up this morning, dog brought me coffee to my room. What a morning. Today's gonna be good. I'm actually gonna take you guys through a little bit of my skincare routine and then try out a few new products that I got sent. I'm going to OKSIS's virtual live event today, which I'm really excited for. I don't know why Dom and I specifically haven't thought about doing a podcast live event because our dream absolute dream is a podcast live tour so anyways i'm going to take you guys through my skincare routine so thank you to curology for sponsoring today's video but i share curology products even when it's not sponsored because i love them so much you guys saw my vlog i want to say it was in december i shared the same routine i wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update i have like two hormonal um breakouts up here which actually went down so much with my night cream. We'll talk about this. Uh, I wake up and my skin has a very even complexion, which I never really have that. So that's like my number one thing. You can go on the Curology website. What's cool about Curology is it's not even just like a custom algorithm. It is actually like a dermatology provider for you personally. They get to know your skin. They ask questions. They get updates. Um, they're the best. So I have my cleanser and then I go in with my moisturizer at night I cleanse my face and then I this is like my night cream So I'm gonna go on with this. So I'm gonna wash my face Anyways, I'm really excited for today. We're going to OKSIS's podcast virtual tour, which I love also I'm really picky when it comes to face cleansers Like if you have really kept up with any skincare online, you know how picky I am with face cleansers because I find them most of the time they dry out my skin, and this is by far my favorite face cleanser, hi guys, I have ever used. Next thing I go in with is my moisturizer. This is so good. I actually, I apply this morning and night, and then at night I will apply this stuff, and this is like the best thing ever. My offer is really insane too. It's free for the first month. You just pay $4.95 for shipping and handling. Also, it's convenient because it's like all together, and you're not using a ton of different products from everywhere, and you don't know what to do they put together something for you moving on to my favorite product of this i can't use it right now because it's morning but i use this at night what is so great about it is i had these two breakouts last night which honestly they're probably my first two breakouts in like two months they're just hormonal what's so cool is like these were huge last night and i put this on and they went down so much so i woke up to that and then i wake up to a really even skin complexion which i never really have and that's been the one thing about my skin i didn't love and this stuff has just been like changing my life. You go on curology.com, you're able to upload photos of your skin. They create a custom formula for you and they also have a dermatology provider. So if you find that your routine isn't doing anything for you, they're able to make some adjustments and switch that up. I've been using them for months. I absolutely love them. Cannot say enough good things. Again, I have such a great offer. Your first month is free and then you only pay for shipping and handling, which is $4.95. I will have it linked down below. I am such a skincare junkie and honestly, like these are my go-tos now. Love them. So I will have the offer down below. Thank you to Curology for sponsoring this portion of the vlog. All right, so I actually need to get ready for the day. That is the next step. I have some new makeup products that I wanted to share with you guys. House update again. So by Thursday of this week, everything will be done besides my office. The kitchen will be done. Downstairs, I think they're kind of wrapping up the final stuff. They have to do some like painting. I don't really know what's happening. So that's excited. I'm excited to have my house back. I'm getting drapes too. So those will come next weekend. I'm just like really living my best life. So Hourglass sent me some products. I love Hourglass. I'm actually gonna start off by using, I'm gonna do like a little bit of light makeup today. Same stuff I've been using, my Rare Beauty Primer, and then my Sephora um, foundation that's legit $20, and it's like my favorite foundation ever. Another thing about the Curology Moisturizer that I wanted to say is I'm very picky when it comes to moisturizers, and sometimes you find, I'm like back to talking about it, but this is what I mean guys, this is how much I love Curology. With moisturizers, I find that sometimes they're like too greasy, too thin, too thick, too much. This consistency is like the most perfect moisturizing consistency I've ever had. So here we are. I don't think I'm supposed to put it right onto the brush. I actually never do that. I don't know why I did that. I just like really had to do my makeup today so I can try out some of my new products. The lighting in this bathroom completely washes me out so it like defeats the purpose because I actually look very tan, but like you can't tell. I'll do this one, sure, why not? Because it could be really rough. Oh, uh, I love this concealer. I mean, I should have gone lighter, but 
Wow. That's my no go-to concealer. Like, no questions. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, guys. Okay, so I read a new book. Of course. I'm on book 14. As we, It is February 6th. I am on book 14 of 2021. I need a life. Um, anyways, I finished Asylum Patient. I started getting back into books as like a thriller girl. That's my favorite. And then I kind of ventured into romance as we know, blah, blah, blah. Back on my thriller kick, um, so good. I really did not see it coming. I posted on Instagram stories last night and I got like literally a hundred responses from you guys saying like, this is absolutely, they were like, yeah, it was crazy. I have a question guys. These brushes, what are they for? Like it, this I'm assuming is like under eye baking. What is this for? Is it just, is it concealer? It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Hourglass, I love because I love their dim light powder. This is the luminous bronze light and ambient. Lighting bronze. Okay, I like anything that's like illuminating, you know? Okay, moving on to blush. We have another one of those. Don't worry. This is really bright, but really cute. I'm going to slightly go on. This is not, the, this is literally not my brush for blush. Okay. You know when you just feel like you're not fully there? That's how I feel like every time. Okay, so this is ambient and dim light. So I used to put this on top of a cosmetic CC cream. Molly showed me this combination like three years ago. The best combo ever. I can only imagine this could be incredible with my new favorite foundation. But it gives you this like perfect glow. It seems like one of those products that isn't really necessary. But um, once you like go with it, you can't go without. It's like glowing. You guys have literally the lighting in here. This is why I need to do it in my bathroom because you can't even see what I'm talking about. But... Guys, look at my cute little chocolate brown scrunchie. Okay, really going all out with my new products right now. The liner, I'm a huge lip liner gal. What is the difference? What is this, what? Is this for like lip gloss gloss? Like this side, I don't know what the other side is for. You guys let me know. Lip gloss, wow, love. Okay, this has been my favorite mascara lately, the Bite Beauty Mascara. Haven't switched up from this because it's just my fave. This is just so good. I don't think you can even tell. It looks so much better in person. There's not good lighting in here. Let's see, maybe not here. No, even there, it's just not good lighting. Cause there's no, it's really gloomy out. But like, I love how it turned out and it looks better in person, which is unfortunate. Guys, Dom has a serious problem where she's literally trying to become me right now. She just walked up the stairs in a pink juicy tracksuit and the Adidas slides. Oh. Fits. Oh my God, he likes the outfit. Dom, Dom, Ma oh my God, this is the best thing I've ever seen. You know, I used to get bullied in Bible college for wearing juicy track suits. Well, look at it. Wow, it's actually so cute. Do a spin. Oh my God. Hot. <laughs> <laughs> That's hot. Okay, Kenzie, if I had your Uggs. Yeah, do you wanna put them on right now? Like it would just, okay, I don't think they're gonna fit me though. My shoes are your shoes. Okay, I don't think they're gonna fit me. No, what size are you? I'm like bigger, you're like an eight. Yeah, you're also putting the wrong shoe on, I think. No, this is the red shoe. Oh. Okay guys, you know, just trying to slide my foot into Kenzie's shoes. Okay. Oh my God. I have the perfect Bye. TikTok. I, have, I need this. I, need I this. have the perfect TikTok audio for you. You can stop by later. Kenzie, I need this outfit. Please put the Uggs on. I have to get some TikTok footage of you. Just got some Smoothie King. We've been doing our devos. I cannot focus to save my life today. Look at Fitz. Also, later today, I'm going to measure all of this to then go on Ikea online and see how expensive it would be to get this built out into a wardrobe and just really go crazy with designing my own closet here. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go to OKSIS okay live event in like 20 minutes. We are on the OK Sis live event. Comment below if you want Dom and I to do a podcast live event together. It's been very fun. We went on it. Made a little appearance earlier. I just stocked up my fridge. It's not as organized as it normally is. I just have a lot of stuff here. I mean, Fitz has been... Oh, oh wow, Fitz. Are you saying hello? Are you saying hello? Are you everyone's best friend? Are you everyone's best friend? Are you everyone's best friend? Yes. Oh my gosh. You are so handsome. The most handsome of them all. Hi everyone. I had a meltdown today. You can't even see you. It's fine. Um, I have my Mario Minescu things on my face, so don't mind that. But I think I was just very tired and 
anxious and very tired so i took a nice relaxing bath and i tried to nap i didn't really nap um it's four now we've just been laying here i made dawn come into my room um she said she's gonna do work so i was like you can just do work in my room yeah. I didn't understand. She was trying to get away from me. <laughs> nice job. No, I did work and now I'm shopping. Yeah, now she's literally. Oh, guys, you'll never believe this because this is the video with the Curology deal. Dom, on top of all the other things that she's becoming me, tells me she has to go film a Curology deal. Seriously, not even knowing. I'm just saying. Well, I don't know what to tell you, Kenzie. It is what it is. The tides are turning. The people are asking. No, I'm happy to hear this. I'm and just they saying. are also receiving. Guys, make coffee. Dom heated it up for me because I ate it later. What? I drank it later. I'm dead. Look at my cute little Chamberlain coffee. Aww. I think we're going to get ramen for dinner, which is my favorite. Mm -hmm. My groceries came today. So tomorrow, oh, we've decided we're going to go on like a 30-day like habits kick of like getting savage yeah so we're doing our devotionals which i already do anyways but like more um not even more structured just like that's one thing that we're doing okay second thing is we're doing workouts so we're doing 12 through 30 pretty much every day for 30 days we should always have rest days by the way yeah and then um i don't know because i'm not like super into chloe ting workouts but part of me wants to do it just to like do it and then i could also film a video it's not really like my vibe of workouts but then i'm like is that a bad idea guys i've been trying to find the pink track juicy tracksuit um that dom is wearing and it's like nowhere online and we need to match and all of my juicy stuff got left in la so i'll never see it again i used to have like a whole section of my closet for juicy stuff and have to start my collection all over again yeah no kenzie it's really upsetting i'm praying for you yeah so i have to figure it out I don't know why I keep vlogging. I feel like I'm just losing my mind. Losing my mind. Losing my mind. Comment below if you think Dom and I should do a live thing. Our dream, one of our dreams, is a live tour. Like, probably 2022. If that, I don't know. I mean, who knows? That's our dream. But we can start virtually. Let us know. Comment below if you guys would come. I need to see a lot of comments before we commit. Good morning guys, we are in my sister's car. It's much nicer than mine. We woke up really early. Um, also, Dom has been waking up early and this is just like something I can get behind. But we're on our way, oh, we are on our way to Foxtrot right now. Um, it's Dom's first time. It I'm is excited. the cutest place. Besides Tribal, Foxtrot and Tribal are like my two favorite coffee shops. Really good, they also have like little breakfast tacos that are like $3, 100% what I'm getting. So good. That's a fat vibe, bro. Yeah. Exactly. Like, I don't know how else to explain that, but that's just a fat Sunday vibe. Yeah, how are you feeling um, your day after wearing your first Juicy tracksuit? I mean, I feel really hot. Yeah, yeah. It's hot girl energy only. It's real hot girl energy. Yeah. So, I mean... I just feel really hot. I just feel really hot. Okay. I mean, understand why everyone would, you know, just need one, want one. Uh, wear one. Wear one. I mean, could you imagine, like, a short Chanel shoulder bag? Oh, oh my god. And so Coco good. just, like, in my arms? Guys, what's everyone's dream bag? I, you know what's you know what's another weird thing about you, Dom? Dom will always surprise you about things, but another weird thing about Dom is that I remember when you told me your dream bag was, like, a Chanel boy bag, and I was like, Dom, are you okay? Because it's just, like, so not... Yes. Which I understand because it's classic, but it's just, like, so not... I don't know. That's just like, not what I would have expected range. for you. Like, you know, like, it, it's for the basic girls. It's for the alt girls. <laughs> well, now I want one. But, like, yeah. I just now, in the past few months, understood... The hype. The hype, yeah. I'm like, yeah. oh, wait, I get it now. That is, like, the best... I think the best bag that you can get. Well, clearly, well, I mean, clearly, like, the price tag at that point. But, yeah. like, it better be just the, best the, bag. the classic, like... Well, that's the greatest thing about... Wait, show them the truck you want. Oh, yeah, it's right here. Yeah, Dawn wants a truck now, guys. It's so cute. Can you see it? This is a truck. Yeah. Cool guy. Um, They're probably like, why the hell are you? This is are you filming? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I hate us. Um, everyone in Texas is really nice, so... That's so true. Dawn was just constantly shocked. You, <laughs> you have no idea, guys. I mean, the hospitality in Texas... It's unlike any other. Uh, yeah. 
I, also, Dom, like, I anytime she talks to any of the boys that I grew up with, she it's almost like you've had, like, a spiritual awakening and are, like, shocked. Bruh. These boys in Texas, hands down, best guys. Yes. And I'm... Yes. yes. And 100%. you would think, you would think Dom, right? Dom, wow, she, she gets along with the southern boys? Absolutely. Absolutely. Yes. These boys know how to treat a lady. <laughs> And these are just friends. These aren't even... Yeah, these are just friends. Like, just have been friends forever. And yeah. I mean, like, oh, we'll open your this door. This is where I always go wrong is when I don't date a Texas boy. This is where yes. I always go wrong. I told Kenzie. I was talking to, <laughs> to one of your friends last night. I was like, listen, my standards, they're low. <laughs> All I want is a guy who can change oh, a yeah. tire, has a job... <laughs> Yeah. It's something else. I think it was something else. Oh, I said owns a toolbox. I, oh, owns a toolbox. Can hammer. Can, can hammer. hammer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, if I'm like, Slow. I want this But, like, in that. LA, okay, that's the thing. Like, they don't do that there. And it's, like, you guys would think that those are, like, oh, you know, just, like, pretty standard. Like, just, like, the job yeah. thing, pretty standard. But, like, it's really not, honestly. Like, it's, yeah. it's a very they, weird Like, they'll there. be the finest men you'll ever see in LA. Like, so beautiful, you know? Yeah. But then also, I mean... I can't lift a hammer and I'm not saying all Dom wants it's not even it's not, it's not reinforcing even, gender yes, roles no. what it is is that Dom just wants someone who can build things in her house yes. so then she doesn't have to pay for it and, and you know okay or also this I, I can't lie if I were to break down if Kenzie and I were to break down on the side of the road name one guy that would have been able to help us prior to like my Texas boys no, not one I not literally one. can't name one I would literally, if these Texas boys, they'd have the tow truck we would need to, to get the car somewhere. That's how yeah, impressive. They would probably own it already. They would <laughs> own the tow lot, essentially. Basically, yeah. Uh, so, it's really yeah. something. I can't believe I'm trying to get here without any. Um, but yeah, you guys, you would be uh, just shocked by, just shocked by Dom's taste sometimes. Like what yeah. she wants. Because at this point... Why is yeah. the lighting so weird? Looks are nothing. <laughs> you, like, play the old clip of, like, me on your podcast for the first time. Literally once, like... When I was in L.A. Yeah, it's totally. I didn't know anything. It's okay. We were young and dumb then. Same for me. Yeah. And now look at us. Now look at us. Older. Not as dumb. Not as dumb. Not as dumb. Foxtrot. It's so cute. What do you think so far? Yeah, very cute vibes, very cute vibes. Just wait until you get inside. You're gonna be like, whoa. This is just the cutest thing I've ever seen. Okay. I know. So cute, right? Thank you. Thank you. Foggy Fox Latte. Absolutely no surprise here that I got coffee on my pants. Great. Awesome. Got a cool package from after school activities. Said I hope it gives you all the brevity housewife energy. Can't wait. You got this last night. Oh, play nice with after school activities. A nice little tote bag. Very cute. I'll put this here. Dawn also loves tote bags. Oh, a nice black, just like after school activities tea. This is what I'm most excited for. I'm gonna go shower again and um, put this on. Guys, I feel like, I don't know what it is. It's like something in the past year, I will like shower like five times a day. It's been like a nice refresh, you know? Update, my coffee at Foxtrot was actually very good. I think we're gonna get our nails done. This was truly the start to the end. Dom and I have decided that tomorrow we are starting our like 30 day challenge. We're doing 12 through 30 and like a workout challenge and devotional things. So we are going to get healthy. Oh, such a handsome man you are. You are the most handsome. My Neekurology package also came in. You know, my favorite skincare. It's another great thing about them. It just shows up at your door. What vision from God came to you just now, Dom? God spoke to me and he said, Dom, It's I, gonna get copyrighted. Dom, I want you and Kenzie to have a SZA summer. Okay, cool. So, I just, I'm still trying to work out exactly Do without what you will. Means, but it involves this movement right yes. here. That's the summer vibes. Yes, like this outfit maybe? Yeah. Maybe I need to get like you in this cozy, cozy. Yeah, so cozy. So yeah, you know, I mean, ask God what he would tell uh -huh. you. Yeah. But I think that this- You've heard loud and clear. 
Everyone, tell me about what a SZA summer would look like for you. Leave in the comments below. Dom will prayerfully, I'll, you know, I'll prayerfully consider. Ooh, ooh. See, now I feel like, isn't it, she getting even a little, getting a little, SZA summer on the way, because he told you about our 30 day challenge. Ooh. Stop, can, can you turn off the camera? <laughs> She comes back out and twerks. Dom, when people ask us like what we've been up to, Dom just tells them that we've been twerking and working. But where's the lie? <laughs> <laughs> it's like I wish I was lying, but, but like that's exactly what's been what happening. Happened? Yeah, so here we are. My room, I woke up this morning, so cozy. You guys have no idea. Let me show you Ooh, what I'm wearing. Cozy outfit. I My cute little after school activities crew, these old sweats. Here they are, and sneakers and socks. A very Sunday outfit. We're gonna go get our nails done. I actually, these are like my favorite way I've ever gotten my nails done, but they need to get fixed, and I think I'm just gonna do a different color and go back and forth. Oh my gosh, Fitz. Do you just love the camera? Do you just love the camera? Good morning, y'all. The besties are getting their coffee. Hey, so Look at how cute they are. I don't even care how bad I look right now. It's really good. It's called the the perfect, I think. Oh my god. Guys, Dom. Okay, so we went to okay, a nail Fiona. place. Okay, Shrek. We didn't go to where I normally go. I normally go to um, the Mockingbird Station nail salon. I don't think that's actually the name, but it's at Mockingbird Station. I'm pretty sure it's the really big one right by Core Power. Um. But I actually really like it there. They're so fast. That's the one thing I will say. Like I felt like we were in there yeah. for three hours. No, yeah. When I go to Mockingbird, I'm in and we're out like 45. In and, and that's out. yes. And this with tip, $75. $75. Dom, when I go to it's normally like 40 bucks with tip. Well, actually, okay, and you like know me, things, so Kenzie, really sure Like we're so Gen Z that like if someone literally gave me the wrong color, I'd be like, oh my god, perfect. Like I'm. Obsessed. Oh, I would never say. Well, at first I didn't like these because they were too rounded. As you guys, they're not. I normally get like a little bit more of a coffin shape. Here you go. You get my. Yeah. Um, I just had to change it up. I like the white better. But. <laughs> Dude, mine is literally. I actually on like Shrek. your nails. Mine's literally on Shrek. No, I think it looks good. I'm though. serving matcha green tea. No, here, I like the color. The problem isn't the color. The, the problem the shape. is. No, it's like it's the way she did it. It's lopsided. Yeah, like it's not. <laughs> Oh, and like Dom and I kept telling, I literally kept, I was like, hi, can you, I was like, oh, you could did. you file it down more? Could you file it down more? Could you file it down more? They're not so even. Go, Whoosh, and then be like, okay. And I'd be like, more. <laughs> but I was like, I can't like turn up on her. Like, not during Black History Month. No, <laughs> so I was like, okay, I'll just like chill and like whatever. But yeah. I definitely, it's so hard. Because I used to work in like the service industry too. Yeah. So it's you. like you want to be respectful because you know like yeah. how hard it is for that job. I know that job so freaking hard. Oh, I would never say anything. Yeah, I will walk same. away and hate my nails, pay and leave before I would. Same, like ever. straight up, give yeah. fat tip, everything. 100%. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And I was like, bro, I was bleeding in that house. Well, I like also, I, okay, you know, I've never been to Eatsy's. Eatsy's is like such a Dallas thing. We need to go there. Um, what is that? I know, it's like a market. We'll go. Oh. I'll show you. Um, yeah, so Dom just literally said that it looks like Fiona is what she said. Literally Shrek. on Shrek. Like I like the color. Fiona. It's the way your nails... Like, if you can see my... I mean, you guys know what nails look okay, like Okay, if they good. were longer, too, they'd be, like, period. But it's because they are, like... You know the, when they show you a picture of, like, bad nails? That's like what, like it looks like almost like oval, like those oval nails. I told you. Listen, I liked that place actually better because it was open and had a lot more natural lighting. I like the vibe better than my place. Yay. I'll say that. But the pricing and the people, it was just like. Yeah, it was just a disconnect. And also. Focus. I want some Shrek. I'm on my Shrek BS right yeah, now. Like I'm on my Shrek grind. I'm literally about to be like, if y'all don't cast me in Shrek 4, like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna call my agent, girl. Girl. I'm gonna be like, y'all better, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pitch to DreamWorks and be like, so y'all trying to do round four? You should make an Instagram story and say that. Shrek This is the stuff, Dom, like, 
you know in old school YouTube when it was like just random videos that were like absurdly funny would blow up? Yeah. Back in the days of like, no, okay, not that Fred was like this, but back in the era that Fred was popular on YouTube. Yeah. Like remember the shoes video, things like that? Oh, yeah. If you were to just, like this is what I need to do. Like when you start talking and telling things, especially when you're like telling other people, because I, I always think you're funny and I laugh at everything, but I forget that like people aren't no, used to you yeah. being on this level at all times. Like I need to start recording that and then like that's what we need to post on the internet. Yeah. Because then um, maybe you could be like famous. Yeah. Uh, street ends no outlet. Great. So I'm so glad that I decided to turn into it. Yes. Like, super nice. I agree. Yeah. I definitely need to exploit myself more. Yeah. I mean, we're all for exploiting here. Yes. Oh, and she's super glued, bro. My <laughs> nail. To, like, I was actually waiting for that to. My nail. Like, guys, it, my skin. Look at the super glue. It's still on my fingertips. Do you think that Gorilla Glue is having like any sort of. Do you think that this whole scandal, in quotes, has affected their business, like, negatively or positively at all? I mean, probably positively. Yeah, because you're like, I would trust Gorilla, I trust Gorilla Glue, Glue for everything to, now. like, put on Gorilla my shoes. If my, if my shoes fall apart, I'm using Gorilla Glue. Because I know. Rain or shine. Shampoo, no shampoo. I'm going to have to go to the ER. The, did we get an update on her? I wish we knew her name. I don't know her name. Did we get, guys, if you don't know what we're talking about look up the gorilla guru drama um as of right now she is in the hospital trying to like get it lifted i hope what well, does she has to like shave her head or something well okay here's the thing so she they gave her so she went to the er and the last i heard she was they were trying the products at home that the hospital gave her but it was like burning really bad so i'm like that's so scary because what if she has like chemical burns and everything i am so worried for her we're seriously like keeping her in our thoughts and prayers this weekend Ooh, like that's like my worst fear and like got to be uh, hair glue is very savage yeah, like so you use that that's literal like glue for your hair so i don't know guys so as i'm editing this dom is in my room gorilla glue is trending and gorilla glue has released a statement apparently she's trying to sue them she put the glue in her own hair so like dom is like no well, so dom is not because having she said it said she was like on the label it said do not use on eye skin blah 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 and there was no mention of hair like if you wouldn't put it in your eyes if you wouldn't put yeah. it on your skin i wouldn't put it on my hair yeah like, i don't think i mean gorilla glue is not a hair product though <laughs> okay we are aware of the situation and we are very sorry to hear about this unfortunate incident that miss brown experienced Ooh, Miss Brown uh, experienced using our spray adhesive on her hair. This is a unique situation because this product is not indicated for use in or on hair as it is considered permanent. Oh, I didn't even think about how permanent this is. For some reason, I'm not even thinking. Okay. Our spray adhesive states in the warning label, do not swallow, do not get in eyes on skin or on clothing. Well, that's where they went wrong, though. Mm -hmm. she, I don't know. Hair. It is used for craft, home, auto, or office pro Auto. <laughs> to mouth things and services <laughs> such as paper, cardboard, wood, laminate, and fabric. What? We are glad to see in her recent video that Miss Brown has received medical treatment from her local medical facility in Wish Her the Best. <laughs> Like, guys, look at the side by side. I don't know if you can really even tell. I don't, okay. Like, look, <laughs> look, look. It's botch. It looks like a sour apple, bro. Like, this is really like on some Fiona. Like, her nails long. Like, her makes her fingers look skinny. Mine are like short, dusty. Like, oh man, like, what? Look, like, shiny cuticles. Look, she literally made, I bleed. I'm bleeding. Woo! <laughs> Derek Black is true. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's how they finna do you. Mm, don't go. Don't go. Stay home. Mm. <laughs> Guys, this is actually my last weekend with these counters and without my extended counter. How exciting. Just came home to a package from Kapari. I actually, this is like one of my favorite lip products of a lot. I can't wait for Super Bowl 2022. Watching the Super Bowl when I'm not at like something Super Bowl correlated. It's just like depressing. Anyways, um, we're ordering. Okay, we're ordering Wingstop. We're gonna watch the Britney Spears Hulu, at least I'm watching it, uh, documentary, which of course I'm so excited for. I used to be very up to date in the free Britney movement. I like really had a second there with that and um, I feel like the, the Netflix thing or the Hulu documentary is only gonna make that 
that much better, you know? This is Stop, this has gone too far. This, this literally... has gone too this is far. literally me. <laughs> me and my new nails, me and my, me and my new, me and my new, look, this is me. I'm mm -hmm. here. Guys are watching the new Free Britney thing mm -hmm. and ordering Wingstop. That is it for this weekend of my life vlog. I am running off four hours of sleep, so I am so tired. It is 7 a.m., 7 p.m., and I'm going to bed. Again, I will have Kerology's information linked below. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Love you guys, and I'll see you soon. I do feel like in our generation, everything revolves around alcohol, though, and that's something that I feel like I struggle with as well because I am really passionate about health and wellness and I know how it affects me in a negative way and I do feel pressured sometimes that I can't say no like oh I don't want to get a drink at dinner with my friends because I don't want people to say stuff like I know my friends would be so supportive and they wouldn't make me feel bad